Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the intersection of two lines in the plane. The intersection of two lines can be found in three ways. The first way is when the lines are in the slope-intercept form. For example, suppose we have the following two lines. Where A and C are the slopes of the lines, and where B and D are the y-intercepts of the lines. For example, let's consider these values. At the point where the two lines intersect, both y-coordinates will be the same. Therefore, we get the following equality. Now we solve for x. To find the y-coordinate of the intersection point, we can substitute the value of x into either one of the two line equations. For example, we can substitute it into the first equation. Hence, the point of intersection is given by these pair of coordinates. Naturally, if A and C are equal, then the two lines are parallel and there is no intersection point. The only disadvantage of this method is that the lines must be non-vertical. The second way is when the lines are in the so-called general form. The parameters of this line are easily interpreted. Minus A over B is the slope, minus C over A is the x-intercept, and minus C over B is the y-intercept. For example, suppose we want to find the intersection of two lines defined as follows. The first step is to represent these two lines as two 3D vectors. We can do this by simply stacking the coefficients of each line into a vector. The second step is to take the cross product of these two vectors. If CP is equal to zero, then the lines do not intersect. Otherwise, the two lines intersect at this point. The third and last way is when the lines are defined by two points. For example, consider the intersection of two lines L1 and L2. L1 being defined by these two points. And line L2 being defined by these other two points. The intersection P of these two lines can be defined as follows. When the two lines are parallel or coincident, the denominator in these two fractions is zero. That's it. That's how you find the intersection point between two lines. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching.